Oh gosh, there's so much new music and so many reaction videos I'm behind on. So many covers I gotta do still that aren't done. I don't know how I'm gonna get all this done. I'm, I'm just completely overwhelmed. Oh, what should I do? No, 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 don't sulk, don't sulk, don't sulk. You can do this. Just need to get up and deliver this and Welcome back to the channel. My name is Jake. This channel is called Jake of All Trades and go figure. I, I begin working on the, the Spirit Lives On by Love Bites um, and then they drop a new music video for Stand and Deliver. Uh, the quotations being shoot him down. Um, and I'm I'm excited that there's actually a new music video to check out and be able to kind of like see the performance of the, the song because then you can kind of get a little bit more of an idea of like um, what they're doing and if you're not hearing it like it's buried in the mix or something You can kind of see what they might be doing like to get some hints at that. So should be fun. Uh, looks like it's uh, based on the thumbnail um, like more of a Performance oriented music video, but I guess we'll that that remains to be seen. So um, without any further ado Let's check it out. Okay, stand and deliver shoot them down. Here we go. I'll take note of those uh, those settings. Nice crunchy bass for me. Got some trouble dive bumps up. Ooh. Like the gang vocals. I also like the different uh, outfits that they've been using for this album. This feels so different for them, but it's... Ah! Uh, it's refreshing. Feels very like classic rock oriented. We bring something new to this world. Nice blend.
That Germany there kind of felt like a machine gun. Thinking of shooting him down. such a ride all right so i am i really enjoyed that track um can like a lot of love bite songs have like a very very thrashy element to it um and like i just did the spirit lives on um and i'm still working on that video uh, as i'm recording this <laughs> um but the thing is is that like th that song felt like just thrashed the entire way through but this one felt like um like a different subgenre of metal where, like whereas they do like uh the other track was like um thrash or, or power metal this one felt a little bit more like had a little bit more of a classic vibe to it like classic metal vibe to it so, um like one i'm not sure if this is the greatest comparison but um like kind of like a like an older metallica vibe um but you know a little bit more chunk more modern tone down tuned um from like the standard e um at least i think anyway i <laughs> didn't test it out um i only got a little bit of time to record this so anyway um, um with judgment day they definitely featured fami and um we're really trying to highlight her there um and then when i did the spirit lives on it's like i couldn't really pick her out there she didn't really seem like like obviously she's important to the track but it she wasn't like featured the same way she was on judgment day and so i was wondering like what i was gonna get out of this one and they definitely like they're they're featuring her again like with the the starting of the very crunchy bass at the beginning um just a really really nice way to um incorporate her and highlight her and really just um help her bring like her unique element to love bites uh, which has been really, really quite a joy to see so far, and um, and with this style overall too, um, it's been really, really cool to kind of hear them change up that pace a bit. Um, you know, with the the shoot 'em down line, like I, I loved uh, the little like how the snare kind of just sounded like a machine gun or something. Like it just like it just fits so well um, with the with the song title. Um, also, like. I loved how Midori's and Miyako's um, guitar solos were completely different from each other. It's like, like the kind of song where it's so unified, especially in the chorus with all those like great harmonies. Um, but then like everything's got like its own bit of personality to it. Miyako's solo, Midori's solo, Fami's um, bass playing style in the intro, um, Haruna's um, drumming, and, and like the, like I said, the, the thing that stood out to me as a non-drummer, <laughs> uh, I'm not gonna be, pick up on all of her nuances and drumming and stuff, but um, like the thing that stood out to me was that machine gun type snare, and um, you know, Asami's vocals are, are fantastic, but like um, going back to that chorus, I, I loved the layers of harmonies there. Um, like, I, I I haven't heard that from Love Bites, at least not as far as I can remember, at least from the tracks I've heard so far. Usually it's like maybe one harmony vocal or something, but this was just like everybody, like it sounded like a four or five part harmony right there. And I, that was incredible. And I'm there's like, it, it gave me some kind of classic rock vibe um, from, I can't think of who it is, and I'm sure during the editing I'll put like a little note like when I think of it. Um, I just don't want to wait until like God knows when <laughs> to be able to like 
be like, ah, that's what I was thinking of. So, um, what a, what a cool track. I I love the change. I loved uh, just kind of how it distinguishes itself from a lot of other Love Bites tracks. Because as great as Love Bites is, some of, some of their tracks are just like, okay, straight thrash all the way through. And um, this one also just kind of like takes you on a journey, but it also has just so many unique pieces to it that ah, oh, just make it makes this track especially stand out. Uh, but those are all the thoughts I have on this specific uh, song at this time. If you haven't already, please leave a like on the video, subscribe to the channel, turn on all notifications so that you don't miss anything going forward. If you have any recommendations for other Love Bite songs you'd like me to check out or um, any other band, please drop it in the comment below. And if you have any um, any guitar covers or vo vocal cover requests that you'd like to see me do, also drop those in the comments. I'll give you a shout out whenever I do any of those videos. And also I want to thank BM for Life and Jonas S for support supporting me on Patreon. I really, really appreciate it. But that's all for today. Thank you so much for watching. God bless you and rock on. Ah, oh, fudge nuggets!